Barbeck is a proud sponsor of local H&R Preps. Kelly, I just got a new cell phone. It's awesome. And I just shot a video of Nick at the game tonight. Oh my God, he is so cute. I'll send it to you right now. We help you stay connected with a cute picture here and there. Buy local. Buy Barbeck. Hello, Herald Review Sports reporter Leroy Bridges out here in Moreau Forsyth High School. Day four action of the Macon County Boys Basketball Tournament. St. Teresa, the five seed, took on top seed of Meridian the first, game, the first game of the night. St. Teresa falls to Meridian 67-56. It was a game that uh, was kind of back and forth in the second half. The Meridian jumped out to an early lead, uh, dominated the first quarter, and, and led the Bulldogs 15-4. Uh, St. Teresa fought back, down seven at halftime, and had a big third quarter behind uh, Alex Tuith. Tuith helped the Bulldogs cut their deficit to two, 42-40, going into the fourth quarter. But Meridian went on a pretty big run. They opened up the game. Opened up the game. It was a 54-45. Uh, the start of that uh, fourth quarter on a 12-5 to, uh, to five run behind Jordan Ramey. Jordan Ramey, the transfer from Saragordo, finishes with 23 points. Uh, Meridian battling some sickness tonight, but still got 16 points from Caleb Brown and uh, 17 points from Michael Tag. They were without uh, Bryson Barnes most of the night. St. Teresa gets 29 points from, from Tuith, also seven rebounds for their post player. Really, a, a, um, Coach Tom Noonan for St. Teresa called him the Energizer Bunny. Does a lot of work for St. Teresa down low. Again, Meridian beats St. Teresa 67-56. Top seed advances to Friday's uh, championship game. Takes on the number two seed Warrensburg uh, Latham Cardinals. Should be a pretty good game. Make sure you check out hrpreps.com for full coverage. We've had you know three different leading scorers in four games. We've got to have a night where we're all clicking. And once we do, I think we could we could be a, a lot better team. And you know, Alex worked his butt off tonight. But if we hit some outside shots, we sure do make his fourth quarter, third quarter a little bit easier. The great team. I got a great team behind me again. Like I said it last time, I got a, I got a great team to fall back on. I don't have to do everything. You know, I got I got good shooters, good scorers out there. And we got to pick up our inside game. I think we got to get more, more out of Tyler and more out of, of Caleb and more, you know, inside and, and, and with the with the sophomore Dylan Smith and, and they will, but they all got in foul trouble, you know, trying to guard to us and they were trying to go up and block shots and, and you got to just play position and, and get vertical with them and, and not try to block shots and we're not going to block a lot of shots but we can play a good position and block them off, and so I think they can do that, Leroy.